Hello guys, we are highly welcome to another tutorial on Obuti Fashion Channel. On this video, I'll be showing you how to stitch uh, this uh, design that I have on the side of my trouser. As you can see, I use a sequence material on the top and I also use it on the on the trouser as well. You can also use any material you feel like to make uh, this uh, design. So please, if this is the first time you are checking on this channel, you are highly welcome to Nobuti Fashion Channel. So without any further delay, let's get started. As you can see, here is the trouser. I've already sewed it already. So I have to lose it because I want to fix uh, this design by the by the side. So here is the sequence of material that I'm using. I've already for the, the side. So the length of this is a uh, 6.2 uh, while the wideness is a uh, 1.5. Uh, so you apply ST at the back and then you fold it around like this. So you leave this side the under without a uh, folding and then you fold this one round. Then the measurement for this is a 1.5 by 6 inches by 6 inches. So that is the measurement for the second one after you have already folded it. And here is the material. I've already lost the inseam and this is the side where the, where the pocket is that we show outside. So you place the material like this so you can see this line. So here it is. You can see this. So you put, place this uh, design on it like this so the first one that i showed you that is the one we place under like this and then you stitch it straight so this this now you have prepared the loop so you cut the loop into like a 2.5 so you cut this one into two so you see this is like a 2.5 then you cut another one also into 2.5 so after you do this you take this uh, buckle that i'm using you can see these are the where they are selling a tailoring material or you get go to the place where they are selling a shoe making or bag uh, material so those are the three places in which you can see this type of a uh, iron that i'm using so you place it under it like this and then you stitch it straight up so when you get here you stop and then you turn it like this so to make it easier for you you can as well use a office pin to hold it together then you stitch it straight down like this That is it. So now to do the second one, you will take the loop which we prepare and then you insert it like this also. And you take the second the material and then you place it on it. So you fold it like this and then you place this uh, material on it like this. So you can as well use office paint to hold this to make it uh, easier for you to stitch. And then you stitch it uh, round. That is it. So you enforce it here like this. So once you are through, you go to the you do this same thing on the second leg also, and then you press it from the back, press it like this, and then you stitch the inseam back. Once you are through with this, so let's see the results. <laughs> 